Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the Summer of Retro, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Let's Play. I'm your host as always, Ron Tro, and we're still working on Summer of 2017. I'm hoping to get 20 started on 2018 here very soon. Alright, so we're going to need this. Do we save you? And today we go in the dreaded water temple. I'm hoping I can do it without a problem, but I'm not promising anything. If you do happen to hear any noise in the background, I apologize. Kitty is watching uh, Neighbor's Kid again today. Okay. My controller is acting all on its own. There we go. Now maybe we can do something. Oh, I've come back to life. Was it you who saved me? Don't be nervous. It looks like you have a hard time breathing underwater. As an expression of my gratitude, I grant you this tunic. With this, you won't choke underwater. You got the Zora tunic. This diving suit is adult size, so it won't fit a kid. Wear it when you, and you won't drown underwater. Okay. Controller seems to be acting normal now. So it stays that way. We're going to go back here real quick now that we have that outfit. And have the iron boots. Because I will end up forgetting to come back here, so we're going to do this now. Instead of waiting for one of our scavenger hunts, as I like to call them. I mean, it kind of is like you're on a scavenger hunt looking for all these pieces of hearts and stuff, so, I mean... Did I not have them? Okay, I have them on. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear that in the background. Hopefully not. So yeah, I was going to do this video a couple days ago, but uh, things fell through with getting it done. And then yesterday I was going to do it, but uh, they released Arena of Valor onto the Nintendo Switch, which I've been playing on the phone here and there, uh, on my phone, through uh, Google Play. You could download it and play it on, you know, phone, tablet, whatever, anything that plays mobile apps. Now, I didn't put a whole lot of time into it, and I kind of wish I would have, because the more characters you had unlocked, the more of a reward you get for playing on Nintendo Switch by putting in your ID onto the mobile version, your player ID onto the mobile version. So I'm literally only getting 100,000 coins. I could have had like 40 red gems, but I literally needed one more character, and I have enough to buy another one. But I already, you know, used my code, so kind of messed that up. You can get a, a a frame too, a portrait frame, and you can get a a character skin that I'm never gonna get because you have to have 50 characters unlocked just to get that skin. And I've only been playing it for a couple months, so I literally stopped playing it once I found out it was coming to Nintendo Switch. I was like, well, there's no point in me putting more time into the mobile game when it's coming to the Switch. And I was hoping it would, you know bring over all the stuff you did have unlocked no all you can get is money to well, we don't need anything in here like I literally did it to uh, get gold and that's it you don't get the characters you had unlocked you get nothing just just the gold so glad I didn't put more time into the mobile Okay, we need to play this. A down, right, right, left. My win-loss record on the Switch already is at like 50-some percent. Keep getting teams that just don't know what they're doing. The first three games went great. 
I even went like 23 kills, one death in the one match. And now I'm lucky I even get a kill because I keep getting teams that are god awful. It's a game like League of Legends if uh, you've ever played that. It's a, it's a MOBA, they call them. There's a lot of characters missing from it, like 43, I think. And that's not counting the DC characters, so... There's a lot missing from the game, and it's not as up-to-date as the phone version. But I'm sure that'll change in time. I'm sure they'll add more, you know, all the characters at some point. Probably little by little. But I'd much rather play it on the Switch than on uh, a mobile device. And control so much better on the switch yeah I'm talking about a game that has nothing to do with what I'm doing but that's okay yeah, let's dive on in quite literally okay let's see let's go down this hallway first We're not following this person quite yet. Oh, you. If I'm right, Rontro. You're Rontro, aren't you? It's me, your fiancé, Rudo, Princess of the Zoras. I never forget the, or forgot the vows we made to each other seven years ago. You're a terrible man to have kept me waiting for these seven long years. But now is not the time to talk about love. I'm sure you've already seen it. Zora's domain totally frozen. A young man named Sheik saved me from under the ice. But my father and the other Zoras have not. Yet. I want to save them all. I want to save Zora's domain. You, you have to help me. This is a request from me, the woman who is going to be your wife. Rancho, you have to help me destroy the evil monster in the temple, okay? Inside the water temple, there are three places where you can change the water level. I'll lead the way. Follow me quickly. No. I will not follow you. I'm not done down here. I just so happened to pick the right door. Okay. All right. I can tell you already we can't do anything in this room, I don't believe. Okay, we cannot. We cannot go that way at the moment. And we cannot bomb that. So we are done at the moment down here. So now we got to float to the top here. If you have never played this game, and you plan to, you're going to hate this part with a passion. Most people do not like this part of the game. It really shouldn't even be that difficult anymore. I, I've beat this game more times than I should probably admit to. I, I honestly can't tell you how many times I've beat this. I guarantee it's more times than I have fingers and toes, though.
It doesn't matter how many times I play this game. I, I can't get tired of it. Which is one of the reasons why it is part of Summer of Retro. Because it's worthy. It, it is a fantastic game. Let's see if I could do this with the arrows. Again with an N64 controller. There we go. Banks. Really? You're going to start. Yeah, the cat hasn't made a sound all day until I start doing a video. And now she's going to be rude. That's the cat you've seen on uh, camera here a few episodes ago. The, you've got to be the most annoying cat of all time. Well, let's go check out that place where I couldn't bomb. Alright. We need boots. As you see, we are coming in here with one fairy. But that's okay, because there are more throughout the game. Or not throughout, yeah, well, there is throughout the game, obviously. There's some throughout here, the water temple, that I will grab a hold of. Because I'm confident enough I can get to those without dying. Huh? Oh, we got another one of those. Is there? Okay. I was making sure that wasn't a water spot. I was going to say, I didn't think so. And if, there, if it was, we never had to use it before. Well, it wasn't. So, good. The only part I worry about not having any fairies is the mini boss in here. Not sure if I'm going to be able to beat him without having some fairies. Can't remember if we get any before we get to that mini boss or not. I'm hoping so. Okay. Go up here. We're going to push this. Oh, my. Now, we know that we cannot go the other direction. At least not yet. Yeah, I wish there was an easier way to switch the boots. You gonna get up there? Or what? Alright. that. Let's 
current tick meter here. I'm really looking forward to doing, getting the 2018 stuff done. Yeah, I do not like this part. Come on. Nope. This part is not going well. There we go. And that was not going well. Oops. There we go. Didn't want to have to charge it. And waste magic. Have the current take us back to here and... Ooh, I almost didn't get back up there. As you notice, the hook shot is a key component in this place. Oh, that's right. We got a hook shot up to this one. Health would be nice. Or jump back down. Should be okay to do this now. I think I did everything I possibly could down there at the moment. Even deeper into the water temple we go. Yeah, we'll do this from a distance. And that is why.
You know, some health would be really nice, guys. Making progress. This is actually going smoother than I expected it to go so far. Oh, excuse me, I have hiccups. Apparently. I just ate lunch before I uh, started playing, so... <sighs> Moving on. We're going to jump back down in here. We're going to go to the area that uh, where Princess Rudo was. Wow. If that wasn't a cheap shot, I don't know what is. That was a cheap shot. Well, at least this is turning out to be a uh, pretty decent run of the water temple and should be able to use it as a walkthrough if you're following along. Providing I don't screw it up from here. I think we are done down here until we can get up into that one area that I said we could not get to. What mind some spiders coming down to fight or tech tights, I guess they're called in this. Without getting hit would be nice. Well, I guess not. Alright, let's go this way first. What do we have here? Oh. We're gonna come over to here and back off because that's why. And still, no hearts. Lovely. I do not like being down to six and a half hearts. Okay, I don't know why it switched to hook shot. Oh no, we don't want to do that yet. We do not want to raise the water level yet. All right, fine. There we go. Some health. And more. And more. Sweet. Almost full. But yeah, after this, I will more than likely be playing some more Arena of Valor. Actually, I may just put my Nintendo ID in the description below. And maybe you can all join me in playing. That reminds me, I did not put in any of the links that, that I told you guys I was going to put in the last video. I need to go back and 
can edit and do that. Oops. Remember, I also am putting these videos on BitChute. Um, BitChute.com, just look up Rontro Gaming, you'll find me there. I'll even, if I remember, I'll put a link in the description below. And uh, also, if you want all the latest news that uh, Rontro Gaming has to offer, I highly suggest getting on Mines and opening an account there and subscribing to me there. You will find more news and find out what's going on more often that way. <clears throat> Excuse me. I used to have a Facebook uh, page for Rontro Gaming. And I don't really care for using Facebook for... Uh, the videos and stuff, so definitely check out Minds. It's a really cool community. I really enjoy it. There's a lot of nice people there. Also, check out RetroMageddon.com. There's guides, reviews, passwords save files we got a, lot, a little bit of everything even movie reviews so i highly suggest checking that site out also look up retro mageddon on youtube uh he has some pretty cool videos he has a he tried to pull off a no death run of ninja guide and then he almost did pull it off i, I highly suggest watching uh those videos um He's done no death runs of uh, some Mega Man games. I highly suggest checking out those videos. Wow, he was totally hitting me and I wasn't taking damage. He was just pushing me across the, <laughs> the, the platform here. But yeah, definitely check him out. Also, check out Froban. He's also on YouTube. Just look up Froban. You'll find him. Uh, he has a couple different uh, series that he does there. Like Poppy and uh, Rushed Gaming. And he has some pretty cool videos. With a little bit of comedy thrown in here and there. So, I highly suggest checking out Froban as well. And yes, I am going to mention them every video, because if I forget to put links up, well, you can at least look them up through their names. After I am done here, I am going to add those links. So by the time you see this video, those links will be there. Oh, this room. Okay, they're out of the way. I'm going to need these, I believe. Is it in here? Maybe it's not in here. Okay. Maybe not. Oh, we'll hold on to them anyway.
really happy this is going as well as it is. Maybe I finally learned this place. This here, I'm going to have to charge. Because the only way over is this, and I am not about to get sucked up by that. I believe there might be a fairy in one of these, so I'm going to get this jar ready. I guess not. Okay. I'll throw these on. Here we go, the mini boss that I'm worried about. Okay, that is a locked door. Oh, who's this? That ain't gonna work. Wow, he just jumped on the top of my sword. Why can't I do that? There we go, there's a hit. Wow. I'd say this version's harder than the Zelda 2 version of him. Shadow Link. Fortunately, I gotta keep taking hits, but I still have at least a fairy left, so I'm not gonna panic too much. Where'd he go? There he is. Come on. I really don't know if there's a strategy to this guy, to be completely honest. This is always how I've had to beat him, just kind of swing my sword and hope I'm, I hit. Definitely don't target him. That's how he gets up on the sword, it seems. Oh, I'm probably using that fairy.
He's probably the hardest part of this game, honestly. Really, I had to hit him one more time. At least it's done. Long shot. Now we can get to that place that we couldn't get to before. Okay, what is the Song of Time? I do not remember. There it is. Right A down. Okay. This is still going better than I could have ever hoped for. Rontro, be careful. Don't get swallowed by the vortexes. These would be the vortexes that Navi was just speaking of. Oh, crap! Uh, swim, 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 swim. Aha! I was going to say, is my hook shot not going to come up? Long shot, as it's called now. Crap, crap, crap. No, 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 no. Yep. There I went. Ah. <sighs> Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up. All right. One of these could be... No! Uh... And down another vortex I go. Shall we try again? Never have a problem with this part. This is one of the easier parts of the place. Yes. Just what we needed. Okay, there's two vortexes. No. Oh. Wasn't sure how that was going to play out. Okay, we can finally leave that part behind. This part should look familiar.
This is going so good. We are probably just going to stick this out to the end of this temple. I can't be too far from being done. Um, yeah, we're almost done. So we're just going to stick with it, finish it up, even if it goes over the 45 minute mark. I need my boots. Because we can finally go to that one place we couldn't go before. Was it this one? I want to say this is not the right way. We're going to try. Might have got myself turned around. Not really turned around. I just went down the wrong pathway. Yeah, I went down the wrong pathway. All right. Oh boy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get out of here. Yes, okay, here we go. Oops. Wow, my aim is way off. That's good enough for me. Come on. Crap. I knew this was going to be an issue. I couldn't even hit those ones that were close up, let alone the ones that are clear back here. This is where I need the bombs.
So I'm surprised I did not get lost this time around. At least so far. Banks, that'll be enough. Again, sorry I have to yell at my cat once in a while. In my videos. Don't want to have to do that. At least I don't have the crazy dog that I had before. I swear that dog knew I was trying to do, you know, something and would purposely act up. Okay, I guess um, I didn't get over here fast enough. I don't know why the camera was just glitching that way, but whatever. There we go. Made it. remember if there's anything down that way or not. We're going to get check it out. What's that way? We're missing a key. Lovely. Well, it was going smooth. Where could I be missing a key? second floor. Okay. I have a general idea where to find it then. So we're going to stretch this out a bit longer, apparently. Don't believe I increased the water the whole way up, did I? I did crap. Ah, I know where I missed it. Okay. Well, unfortunately, we got to be in the water temple just for a bit longer. This isn't the way I need to go. 
almost managed to get the whole way through without a problem. Yeah, if you do one thing out of order, it just makes it one big giant pain in the rear end. Just one thing out of order. One thing I'm curious about. Okay, I have enough for a reward. This is actually, as I said, going pretty decent regardless. I missed one key. All because I forgot to go in one door. I want to go, is this the place that had the elevator things? This is where we need to re-raise some water. Uh, it leads us there anyway. Sorry for one second there. Had an itch. My legs are all bit up. Had a cookout on uh, on Friday and got pretty bit up. Trying to see if I can find that. Um, other gold spider. Alright, you know what? Let's just go and get that key instead of messing around. There's a spider gonna jump down. Where's he at? There he is. Tech tights, as they call them, in Zelda. I just went right through that gate. That's great. Oh yeah, I should have pulled this out first. Oops. So now I gotta go the whole way back around. Again. Like I said, you do one thing out of order, it throws it all off. Let's see if we can uh, do this now.
I believe there is two fairies right here. Nope. I guess not. There's another spot that has two then. Oh, Mr. Spider. There's at least one more of them gold, sc gold sculptures. I can't remember what floor it was on. Like I said, I'm not really worried about getting this anyway, so. We should actually be at the boss by now and have this finished. Can I climb up on these? Yes. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Water's already raised in here, so I can take care of this by just going. Now I'll be able to open the... Ah, oh, crap. God, he was there. Yeah. 
Yep, that's what I needed. Can't get into the boss room without the boss key. So it's this room. There we go. Full on the fairies now. We're going to check some of the top floor uh, rooms real quick to see if it might be in there. So I think I'm literally one away from having all the gold sculptures in here. Thank you, finally. I think I gotta have this to get out, right? No, okay. We are at the end of this temple, thankfully. That is our way out of here. You. Really? Let's see what's this way. Okay. Yeah, I don't think it was uh, up this far. That's fine. We don't need it. Let's just continue on. As I said, I don't really need it. Oh, there's more fairies here, too. Quickly, quickly. Oh, oof, made it. All right, here we go. So I never claimed to be doing 100% run, so. Roger, look out. This isn't normal water. I don't know what the rest of that was. Cat is laying around, so hopefully you won't hear her again. Giant aquatic amoeba. Morpha. Actually, not a very difficult boss, to be truthful. I don't need your tips on how to beat it, know how to do it.
which is more of an annoying boss because you got to wait for it to do that to make a water tentacle come out. It's about the only way to do this. I think it is the only way to do this. Okay, don't shoot my hookshot when I need it to at all. Uh, that works too. It's a good thing I'm not doing any 100% speed runs either. Okay, that went right through him. Ooh, yeah. Watch the spikes. If you're playing this along with me, watch the spikes along the wall. I was using multiple tentacles. Which means he's getting scared. This is what happens when it gets a hold of you. Quite damaging, actually. Oh, come on, that's not enough yet? Holy crap! Still not finished. <sighs> wow. So I do not remember it taking this many hits. There we go, finally. Unfortunately, the video took over an hour, but we got it. Like I said, unfortunately, I didn't get all the gold, gold scotulas in here either. This is one of the places I usually do, but... I'm already pressed for time, so...
So, another temple down. Chamber of the Sages, again. Rontro. I would have expected no less from the man I chose to be my husband. Zora's domain and its people will eventually return to their original state. As a reward, I grant my eternal love to you. Well, that's what I want to say, but I don't think I can offer that now. I have to guard the water temple as the sage of water. Oh, Link's not going to get him a, a fish woman now. And you, you're searching for the Princess Zelda. Ha, huh, you can't hide anything from me. Princess Zelda, she's alive. I can sense it, so don't be discouraged. I can tell that nothing will stop you in your quest for justice and peace. You must take this medallion. Take it respectfully. Here you see the water medallion. Ruto awakens as a sage and adds her powers to yours. I don't feel any more powerful. If you see Sheik, give him my thanks. Or please give him my thanks, okay? Yeah, sure, I'll let him know. And Lake Hylia is a lake once more. As the water rises, the evil is vanishing from the lake. Rontro, you did it. Did Rudo want to thank me? I see. We have to return peace to Hyrule for her sake, too, don't we? Look at that, Rontro. Together, you and Princess Rudo destroyed the evil monster. Once again, the lake is filled with pure water, all is as it was here. And Sheikah's gone. Up on top of the tree, and he has no clue. Before I end this video, I want to do something while I still can. There it is. Might as well grab this while we're at it. What's well, a couple more minutes, right? That actually reads something back there, basically telling you how to get these arrows to shoot your arrow through the morning light through these two pillars or something like that. So. There you go. That's the fire arrows. That's how you get them. All right. So that's going to do it for this episode. Um, if you like what you've seen, give me a thumbs up. Um, any questions, comments, suggestions in the comment section below. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Hit that bell so you can get notifications when new videos come out. And I think that about does it. So... I am Rontro, and as always, until next time, game on.